Hey, this is Peter from Browserling, and I'm really excited to announce Browserling's Live API. Our Live API lets you embed live interactive browsers in your applications on demand. It also lets you interact with the browsers through a very neat JavaScript API. The use cases include automating cross-browser tests, continuous integration, automating interactions with the browsers, secure browsing, and white labeling Browserling. Now let's go to the demo. So here is your awesome web app. Let's embed Internet Explorer 9 in it and navigate to Google. The embedded browser is fully interactive and Live API doesn't require any plugins, Java or Flash. It's all JavaScript and HTML5 based. I'm going to search Google for browser link in the embedded IE9 and then bring up the About menu to show that this is really Internet Explorer 9. Now I'm going to do exactly the same in Firefox 25. So here is Firefox 25 coming up and now I'm going to do Google search for browser link. And now I'm going to open help. You can embed many different browser versions in your application. Just for a demonstration, I'm also going to embed Chrome 40. From programming perspective, embedding a browser in your application takes just 7 lines of code. Now let's take a closer look at the JavaScript API. With the API you can move mouse, click mouse keys, drag, type text and press keyboard keys. Take a look at this code example that I'm going to run in a second. So here I'm setting the browser to IE the version to 9 and URL to my blog catonmat.net. Next I'm making browser link wait for 5 seconds for the website to load, then I move mouse to coordinates x equals 80 and y equals 100, then I left click at the same position and I make browser link wait for 2 seconds again for the action to complete. Next I move mouse to a different position and left click again and then I repeat the same stuff uh, several more times. Then I type browser link, wait a little bit and press the enter key. Then I wait a little bit and perform a triple click. Now let's see the code in action. As soon as browser comes up, browser link runs the script, so it clicks home, then it clicks books, then it clicks projects, then it clicks sitemap, then it clicks feedback, and then it goes to the search box and types browser link and sends the enter key, and then it moves mouse and performs the triple click. Once the script has finished running, the browser is still interactive. For more information, visit www.browserlink.com slash API or email us at hello at browserlink.com.